Dora and her friends were having a wonderful day exploring the magical forest of Alabriges, mystical creatures known for their vibrant colors and enchanting powers. As they wandered, they came across a beautiful crystal guarded by a friendly Alabrige named Luna. The crystal shimmered with a magical glow, and Luna explained, This crystal is the heart of our magic. Without it, our forest will lose its enchantment. Suddenly, a rustling noise caught their attention. Oh no, it's Swiper the fox! exclaimed Boots. Swiper was sneaking up, eyes fixed on the glowing crystal. We have to stop him, shouted Dora, rallying her friends. They quickly devised a plan. Ayase gathered some vines to create a net, while Tico and Benny found the perfect spot to set a trap. Dora and Boots kept an eye on Swiper, ready to warn their friends. Swiper crept closer, muttering, I'm going to swipe that crystal. Just as he reached out to grab it, Dora and her friends sprang into action. Swiper, no swiping, the... All shouted. But Swiper was determined, and with a sly grin, he lunged for the crystal. In an instant, the trap was sprung. Swiper found himself tangled in ISA's net, dangling from a tree. Ah, man, he grumbled, realizing he was caught. Dora approached him and said, Swiper, you have to understand that this crystal is very important to the Alabriges. It's not right to take it, Swiper sighed. I just wanted something shiny. I didn't know it was so important. He looked genuinely sorry. And Luna, the Alabrige, nodded in understanding. Dora smiled and said, Maybe next time you can join us in our adventures instead of swiping. Swiper agreed, and they released him from the net. With the crystal safe, the forest's magic was preserved. Luna thanked Dora and her friends, her colors glowing even brighter. You all are true heroes, she said. As they left the forest, Dora and her friends felt proud. They had saved the day and taught Swiper a valuable lesson about respect and French.